Hello, I'm Anthony Hudson. Welcome to Saturday Afternoon Football. We're coming to you from Docklands. We've been looking forward to this contest between North Melbourne and Hawthorne. Preparations for round one are in full swing. Both sides will be determined to take confidence and momentum into the Premiership season. And here come the visitors. Who's your pick today, Huff? G'day, Hutto. No one would know who's going to win this match. There's very little to choose between these sides. Both have their flaws, which have been spoken about, but whoever can get on top in the clearances will have a big advantage. Fair enough, Huff. Thanks for that. A real buzz around this stadium as the captains meet for the toss. Set now. Let's hope both teams have brought their A game. Goldstein wins the first tap. Simpkin. Can anyone take a mark? He's normally better than that. Larky with half a chance. It's there! It gives everyone a shot of confidence when one of your key forwards is able to hit the scoreboard early. The Ruse are off to the ideal start. The big men fly. Newcomb, the midfield battle so important. Got to get it forward now. He's generally a good kick. McDonald wins it back. Great mark. Doesn't often waste it. Coleman Jones has a vice like grip. Nothing better than to convert a big contested mark into a goal. Clever kick. Larky got to the right position and hung on. This to make a good start, a very good one. Struck it well, no problems there. And that was reminiscent of Tony Plug a locket. The way he used his body. Then went back and put it straight through the middle. The Ruse are up for this. It's a great start. Good ruck work. Simpkin attracted a crowd. Zerha, who's at home? Larky had it and lost it. For a three-goal game, it's there. They've pinched a break. The Ruse are going from strength to strength. They've got all the answers at the minute. It's all one way so far. Goldstein wins it out of the centre. McKenzie. Well, that's not like him. He's completely shanked it. Curtis drops into the hole and marks. If he can nail this first shot at goal, he might just be in for a big day. It's not an easy kick. But I tell you what, he's made it look easy. It doesn't matter who you are, it's always good to get an early one on the board. The Roos have well and truly got the jump now. Goldstein got his palm to it. Davies Uniac, it's a tough game. The umpire says he made an attempt to get it out. 
Reeves showing his skills. McDonald on the same page as his ruck. There goes the kick inside the 50. Zeeble takes an excellent grab. Normally delivers Zerha. Into the pocket he goes. Sicily saves the day. No short options, so he'll roost it long down the line. Zerha reads the ball so well. Going for territory. That's an impressive mark. The Roos have certainly looked a bit aside. They'll be hard to catch. How's the kick? Nothing wrong with that. The Hawks are on the ropes. They need a spark before this one gets away from them. The Roos have got it on their terms. Quarter time and one side will be happier than the other clearly, but there's a long way to go. Gary Lyon is here. Gaz, what are your thoughts on what we've seen so far? The Hawks will be filthy with their first quarter, not just because of the scoreboard, but because of their apparent lack of energy. They seem flat-footed, almost as if they were ill-prepared for the intensity their opponents have brought. They're going to need to flick a switch. It's never easy. I'm inclined to agree. Thank you, Gaz. Davies Uniac goes laterally. Sheasel couldn't keep it in. It'll be tossed back. What are your thoughts, Gary? The Hawks aren't doing their forwards any favours here. It might be time for the coach to switch things up. The two big men do battle. McDonald, Amon, into the action again already. This is promising. It's hard to find a winner for them today. The Hawks moving the ball well. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. Day. Here's the vital kick inside the 50. Lewis is the man on the spot and is marked. What's he got on offer? Lowe is a rock in defence. Penetrating ball. Sloppy disposal and a turnover. Met solidly. Amon moving the footy laterally. No wonder the forwards are frustrated. Up and under. Stevenson. Is anyone home? Zerha had his name written all over it. His goal was so far, but this would be a great way to get on the score sheet. Kicking for his first. He's plucked it and should have a shot. Going at his second. He's got it down. The Hawks have to try something different or this game could be well gone by half time. It's not over yet, but it might be soon. Goldstein had his measure today. Davies Uniac through the centre square he goes. Closed him down. Newcomb. Amon had some assistance. Bruce can run and gun. McDonald claims a terrific contested mark at centre half back. He ran into a brick wall, out of the congestion. Shields, they're moving the footy quickly. Coleman Jones made that kick look good. It's all just a bit easy at the moment. They're getting the ball inside 50 under, not nearly enough pressure. They're playing like champions. This is a joy to watch. For number four. Good looking kick, that'll do. It's a goal. The Hawks need to reset, but I don't think they can afford to wait until half time.
The Roos got off to a fast start and they've kept the foot down. This match appears at their mercy. Let's head down to Gary Lyon on the boundary. The Hawks have been giving the ball back a bit too much. It's been a combination of poor skill execution and poor options, but they need to iron that out because they're undoing some of their good work in winning the footy in close. I'm inclined to agree. Thank you, Gaz. Goldstein gets his hand to it. Davies Uniac. They're hungry for more. Curtis has found some space. Normally a reliable kick. Can he make this one count? Just needs a good bounce. Larky is so strong one on one. Four strikes so far today and kicking beautifully. This is beyond him, you would think, although... Oh, look at that! What do I know? Showing exactly why they want the ball in his hands. The Hawks might need to crack open Plan C in a minute. Goldstein is giving him a bar. Mackenzie, Hardwick, throws it on the boot. Zeebel judged the flight well. He's off. They're leading them a merry dance. Coleman Jones fumbles it. Simpkin. We've got a whistle. Umpire's ball. Goldstein has been dominant in the ruck. McKenzie has been a shining light. That's skillful. Poor footy there. Searching kick. Stevenson. They're irrepressible at the moment. They're putting on a clinic. He hasn't looked like missing so far, so I'll back him in here. That is going very close. Those are the kinds of opportunities you really need to take. Away he goes. Scrambled kick out wide. The Roos have all the answers. They're still hungry. Even with the game put to bed, that's a sign of a very good team. If anyone can, it's him. But he hasn't got that online. Always unlikely from there, but he is capable. Playing for pride now. Was there some holding going on? The Roos have won it back. It'll be a goal one way or another. He's finally on the score sheet. It's been quiet today, but he made that one count. The Hawks will be burning the tape of this match. Goldstein smashes it out of there. Simpkin. They're playing with purpose and poise. Punched away. Coleman Jones with an opportunity. He's caught. The Roos look like scoring every time they go forward. Reeves has rucked tirelessly. Newcomb. Moore. The Hawks are good with their hands. McDonald. Hardwick. What can he do with it? That was almost handed to him. He stopped in his tracks. Got to go quickly. Time running out. They've got winners all over the park. Sheezel has a vice like grip. The Roos have been ruthless today. It's been an awesome performance. Drop punt. That'll be a goal. Never in doubt. These defenders are going to have to tighten up. They've been giving them way too much space. The Hawks have just one more quarter of this torment to endure. The end can't come quickly enough for them. Now for some analysis from Gary Lyon. The Roos fully deserve their lead and they've been better in most areas. But one that stood out to me is their intercept marking. They've almost known on occasions what their opponents were going to do before they knew themselves. Couldn't agree more, Gary. Thanks for that. The big men fly. Davies Uniac. Stevenson. 
They're a delight to watch. Larky couldn't quite. Jack is calm in a crisis. Bruce. Good handball. Day. Probing ball. McKenzie in the clear on centre wing. Misses the target and it's out of play. Gary, what have you noticed down at ground level? It'd be great to see both sides play a more adventurous brand of footy and go after the game. It's been a little dull today. McDonald. Ward has a paddock in front of him. Amon. Not a lot of positives today. Bruce marks inside 50 and can have a shot. Here's a big chance to peg back the margin. Away he goes. Goes long. Goldstein takes an excellent grab. Sees an opportunity and plays on. Kicks to space. McDonald. He'll feel that one. Gathers it cleanly on the wing. Sets a task for the forwards. Sheasel can go back and shoot at goal. This is a tall order, but if anyone can do it, it's him. Don't tell me he's going to kick it from there. He's been on song today, so we really shouldn't be surprised that he converted that one. The ruse in this form would challenge anybody. Goldstein showing his skills. Davies Uniac. He just keeps racking up disposals. Curtis! Great body work. And fancy his chances. Curtis has one already. Now it's two. The Roos are going from strength to strength. Everything they touch turns to gold. The Hawks will be campaigning for mulligans after this. Goldstein wins the hit out. Davies Uniac. Can they find a late goal? Larky takes a beauty. I just haven't had an answer for him, nor many of his teammates, to be fair. We know how good he is in these situations, but not this time. That's a waste. Lucky it's not close on the scoreboard. Away he goes. He's so clean with the footy. Frost on a lead. What a hand pass. Day farms it out. Sloppy disposal and we'll have a throw in. Reeves got his palm to it. Newcomb has covered some territory today. They cannot keep him quiet. That's a strong mark. Ignoring the corridor for now. Good work rate. Almost an accidental intercept. He's got under that one. Sicily tries to spike it out of the danger zone. It's a goal. You turn the ball over there, you've got to expect to pay the price. The scoreboard's about to fall over, it's so lopsided. Goldstein got his palm to it. The Roos are emphatic winners today. The opposition was underwhelming, but you can only beat what's in front of you. That's all for today. Hope you enjoyed the action. It's bye for now.